Uh, I'm Colonel Tim Sandiford uh, of the Mercian Regiment uh, here because I was the last CEO of the Staffords during our tour in Iraq. Uh, we're here today having enjoyed uh, the opportunity to first of all say thank you to the people of Biddulph and Staffordshire as always, one of a number of parades, uh, thanking them for their support, uh, to say farewell to the county for as long as it may be as the battalion goes to uh, Germany to continue its service uh, as an armoured infantry battalion there. And then most poignantly here in Biddulph uh, was the opportunity to pay our respects at the War Memorial to all of those in Biddulph who have given their lives in the service uh, past, and most particularly Jonathan Versace, whose name was the last on the uh, Staffordshire Regiment Roll of Honour. As always, you know, loss of any comrade is, is, a, uh, is a dark and challenging time. Uh, of course, the boys continued with the mission, but I think you know, if you look back and see uh, the services we held in his honour uh, and the attendance at his funeral shows how well regarded uh, he was, and it's a, a delight to have his brother serving uh, with the battalion, which I mean, a remarkably courageous uh, decision, given, uh, given that he and his family have, have seen the price that you may pay uh, at some time. Um, and how has it been generally received today? Fantastic. Uh, bit off in bloom, bit off looks fantastic. The turnout today was magnificent, the sun was shining. We were very, very warmly received and we're very grateful uh, to have had the opportunity to come and pay our respects and to say thank you to Biddulph. It's always a good turnout for the 11th of November, so I thought it'd be a good turnout today. It's been very good. A small town, but they turned out and done, done the regiment proud. And what's it like to see them marching through a little town? Oh, like fantastic. This? Takes me back 50 years. Oh, I shouldn't say that. <laughs>